Hey guys, come on side, it's Ligaya. Welcome to a brand new video that I'm excited to share with you guys. So I don't really know if I have shared this before to everyone here, but I'm actually like a big Swifty. If you need me to sing Taylor Swift songs, like any of it, I can probably do it. Like any. <laughs> so I did love her album so much. The recent one that came out, it's Midnight. And I thought that, hey, maybe I can create some looks based on each track that I love. I thought about it yesterday when the entire cafe that I was like studying on they just um they played this over and over so lavender haze is the one for the everyday outfit and not gonna lie i struggled a bit to create this look and i actually did love the um our what do you call this our final product or something and this song isn't really my number one but i was not able to appreciate it as much because i had finals and in so many subjects and i hate for it to play over and over again in my head so i just ignored it and also the same to anti-hero because um it'll end up looping in my head and i know i'll memorize it better than how i memorize all the theories that i'm supposed to be you know studying so um this is the look that we have created for lavender haze so yeah i do really like it and this is a final product as well i took some pictures you're gonna see me like taking a lot of pictures like this because i decided to just love it anyways next up is vigilante shit when i listened to this i thought it was about like kim and kanye and i was like no this isn't probably because there's no way kim yeah there's no way like taylor would be thick as the thieves with his ex-wife because of all that happened like that's just not possible because of how messed up their fight was and then i also thought of katy perry like about them reconciling so i thought it was like possible but this song is really good not my number one not my favorite favorite but it's good to listen to i guess if you're feeling vindictive or if you're like plotting someone's demise, someone's downfall in your head. So really great. And I've also used this dress. It's the chain dress by Jolie Bean and also this fur by Momo Manu. So yeah, really, really cute. Really, really cute look. And oh my goodness, I loved the photos that I took. I really think she looks good on it and I can't wait to show it to you guys. So here it is. Look at her. She's touching the tiles of the Dalsal Valley thing. And also look at this. I really wish that the fur showed but the fur would not show with the reshade that I was using. So next up is Antihero. Oh my god, this song is my favorite because it hurt. And also it's really um, addictive yeah <laughs> it's just so many there's just so many um lines in the song that just hit different so the line that i like i stare at the sun but never in the mirror made me gasp so hard because it's true like she gagged me <laughs> with this one my self-image and like body issues were like awakened or i was like reminded not reminded i mean it was always there it was always like yeah anyways <laughs> but yeah this song was just something else it was yeah it was enjoyable but at the same time it kind of hurt like you don't understand how many times i've sat at the bus or at like a jeepney listened to this song and had fun because of the beat and then ended up crying ended up my tears like getting my eyes getting wet because of how painful some of the lyrics are so this is it though i've used it for athletic because i don't know it just kind of fit and i listen to this sometimes when i do some stretches anyways so now this one oh my gosh you're on your own kid also another one that i can relate to i look back sometimes in my high school years and not the pack and just like listen to the song because oh my goodness it's it kind of like reflected what i was going through in high school so right here i have created a sim that is like close to crying actually she's been crying her eyes are a little wet her cheeks are all red as well and so are her eyes and i made it look, look a little cozy a lot more cozy and just have her how do i say this in english at first what i wanted for her to do actually is to become like carrie because i think there's like a line in the song blood soaked gown and apparently that is like a reference to carrie which is was which was a movie i guess and i thought i think it was like but yeah it's a really old movie and i think i really like it you guys probably know what carrie is i know 
<laughs> I recently just learned about it because I'm not really like a movie watcher. Like I really cannot sit there and watch like one movie. My attention will be elsewhere. So <laughs> yes, here it is. Um, this is the outfit, kind of. I mean, it's not complete yet because you'll see me changing it. So your own your own kid was like really as well like it really hurt oh my goodness why did she make it hurt so bad and something that so many people can relate to i guess so yep this is the outfit that i have given you'll see the screenshot right here still we were on dalso valley and i just utilized the empty um areas the empty space that it has like the unusable lots as backgrounds Next up is Bejeweled. So this song is fun. I have seen so many TikToks about it. Like, you know, when I turn around and I even had like some of my friends convince me to just be on the TikTok because I can't. Because <laughs> I, I do always like reject those. And I think I did one and I kind of asked them to like delete it. <laughs> I don't know if, it, if they did. But yeah, so this one is really fun to make. Holy shit. So there was like actually like a glitch in this that i utilized and i love because i loved it so you'll see it later because i have did a lot of changes when it comes to her look like i was so in ind indecisive <laughs> why can't i say that word in the first time indecisive about it yeah i was so indecisive and i even utilized first this one right here it's from jolie bean still and i was like it's not sparkly enough i need sparkles this song is bejeweled so i was like looking for sparkles that i can find and i even wanted a tassel a tassel look i mean it's kind of sparkly and also this one and still by my standards it wasn't sparkly enough and i don't really want to use a dress as well so i tried looked and looked on what i can use i've also tried the satin one because it's kind of like sparkly in in a sense in a way so you'll see me like going through a lot of outfits right here trying to make it work that's because i also wanted it to be blue kind of i even settled for dresses like the ones that i've actually downloaded for my historical black widow and then I found this. Actually, it's like the first one that I've chosen for her actually. And I thought of like going for like a plain white, like a plain white skirt or a plain white pants. And I was like, no. So I found this. And oh my goodness, I just placed like fishnet tights on it and I tried to make it work. So here we have, it's actually kind of the final product already. But still, she already looks so pretty and I've used like a hair, um, it's a hair, what do you call this? Like a recolor for your hair, for your sims hair. And it's actually like an accessory so that I can give her like pink streaks all throughout. And I really, really love this outfit. It seemed like a whole outfit in one because of how the glitch affected the skirt. And I loved it so much. I feel like it's perfect even though it's kind of imperfect if you look at it from the from above or like on another angle but in front it's perfect so it's perfect to me <laughs> next up we have snow on the beach featuring the where is lana del rey on this one <laughs> like i laughed so hard with so many of the memes because i don't know even like where's lana i was like where's lana in this like i was listening to it i was like where is she is she gonna be on the last part because i was already like nearing the last and she was still not there I was like oh, okay maybe why why is she why is she featured she probably co-wrote it anyways so about this it's just like really dreamy whimsical i wanted her to have like a coat or something and because it's like snow on the beach so anyways i just settled for this one it's a really quick look and one that i love so much one that i adore because of how simple it is and also the headpiece the headpiece is just so so freaking pretty it was like i think it's by serenity and yeah i loved it i also love how it works on this particular hair so i'll be leaving a link for this ones actually i will be leaving a link for everything on the description it come in the form of like a google um document because there's gonna be a lot and now it is time for midnight rain so this is another one of the outfits that i love so much and i thought of like giving it in the hot weather because of how i don't know 
I just thought of it as hot weather for this hair. I've also given her like something short for this because I wanted to make it seem like she had a wig or so, so that she can go to, I mean, not stalk her ex, but like, yeah, see how he's doing and all that because they had like a bad breakup because of all their differences. So she is wearing right here like a lot of blues, of course, because midnight. And I thought of like black because midnight still, but kind of like the blue was kind of like the center as well of the entire album. So I just went with it. First listen to the song, I already loved it. So it was no surprise that it was like, it's high on my favorite list. Again, Antihero is my number one, but still it's pretty high on my list. It's, yeah, it's a good song. And I don't really have much to say about it because I don't really relate to it but still good song and also i tried to capture like the rain effect in the sims for the pictures but it was not turning out as well as i hoped like they would not capture it maybe it's because of my reshade but finally we are on our cold weather outfit and this one is for sweet nothings oh my goodness have you guys listened to the song and it's just so cozy so i tried to make our sim look really really cozy and also there's like a flush on her cheeks and all that i don't know when i try to listen to this song it feels like i'm in love even though i even though i'm not really <laughs> like it's so cute and it's such it has like such a good vibe so yeah hopefully you guys like this video as well i hope you guys like the looks that i have here and again all the links for the outfits that i've chosen right here are actually linked on the description so go check it out but thank you guys so much for watching and listening to me ramble about midnights if you want to see me do some of these videos again do let me know about it on the comments below and i'll see you guys again soon bye